if you were to go down like that. <laughs> oh, bless you. <laughs> oh, there you are, Lovely to meet you. Dr. Evadney. It is Dr. Evadney. Yes. And Dame Hilda. Yes, that's right. How lovely to see you in the flesh. Thank you. Oh, isn't it nice to it see is. you? Yes, yeah. lovely. <laughs> Glaring, isn't it? Yes. <laughs> Positively. Glaring. He's yeah. quite real. I <laughs> say <laughs> you look enchanting. Thank you very much. And that very soon. She doesn't look bad either, does she? No. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> no. Um, Dame Hilda, uh, how, did, how did you first meet uh, the two of you? Well, it was uh, a well, call yeah. act of fate, really. What? No, carry on, dear. It's all right. all right. No, I wasn't going to say it. Was you please, please, yes. Expatiate. <laughs> it was a cruel act of fate in 1945. Actually, I, it's a joke. <laughs> we met in 1945. 1946. Five, dear. Six. Four, 45 at once. 1946. I remember it very well. It was 40. 1946. Bless her, she's And uh, it was at the... Um, Empire Theatre, to Snitterton, in the Midlands. So it's uh, surrounded on four sides by Birmingham. Yeah. And uh, yeah. <laughs> we were there, well, I was, there was a leading lady, Diva, with the Rosa Charles Opera Company, and she joined as an assistant to the assistant musical director. That's right. It's quite a menial job, really. But well, I was a very city. young girl at the time, you see, 18 yeah. years old, a beginner, really. Yeah, so you, <laughs> Dave you... Hilda was considerably more mature. <laughs> you were older. Still is. Well, <laughs> few months. And uh, I was sitting in the stalls, box of chocolates on my lap. She came towards me, knocked them off with her banjo. I bent down, you see, to pick them up like that. Mm -hmm. Received a size 10 Goodyear gumboot on my hand, crushing two of my fingers and completely destroying my noisy cream. <laughs> That's right. <Yeah. laughs> I said, I do beg your pardon. Allow me to introduce myself. Yeah. My name is Yvadne Mona Montpellier. Yeah. <laughs> That went to. You sort of endeared, uh, endeared yourself to each other. Yeah. my yeah. when we were touring around the country, you see, we stayed in theatrical digs. Oh, did now, you? Now, of course, nowadays, oh, yes, in the old digs, you know, boarding house and landlady. Yes, yes. Because like you that. play the piano, don't you? I do indeed, yes. I do occasionally tinkle, yes. <laughs> and beautifully, I may say. Oh, thank you, Doug. Oh, you do, you know you do. Oh. <laughs> she can't hear me, but she's smiling. Yeah. <laughs> does, does she have a problem with the hearing? Yes, yes, no. yes. What you say, dear? <laughs> yes, she does, yes. Yeah. What about the theatre now? You've, you've, uh, you're a diva, aren't you? Yes, yes, yes. Well, I've worked with several opera companies over the years. And, of course, I've sung some wonderful roles. Benvenutos Cellini, of course, had that. Ben, uh, ben what? Benvenutos Cellini. Verdi's Vermicelli. <laughs> and, of course, I've sung with some of the greatest names. Some of the most wonderful. Milford Plate, wasn't he wonderful? Hey, Milford, yeah. Milford, uh, Milford Plate. Plate. Milford Plate. P-L-E-I-G-H-T. -E yes. Well, I think it was originally French, you know. He liked to... <laughs> Do you remember that time when dear Milford, we were, we were doing one of the big musical comedy shows, I forget which one, and Milford lost his wig in the second act. Oh, right? that was Showboat. Showboat, Grand yes. Theatre Wolverhampton, 1953, coronation year. Mm. Everybody was doing Merry England, and so we did Showboat for a change. Mm. <laughs> oh, I see. <laughs> the place, yes. And Milford was my leading man. And we just go to the duet, and my first line was, I'm walking on the air, dear. And he sort of threw his head back and his wig slid off. <laughs> so I changed it quickly to I'm walking on your head, yeah. You're a very quick thinker, aren't you? Oh, yes. Yeah. Yeah. Just well, not very frequent. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but what, what? Stand and suck it. That was his name. He was the <laughs> Stuckett, Hilda. Sandon Stuckett. Sandon Stuckett. He was the great tenor I worked with. Yes, yes. 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 Oh, he was excellent, mm. yes. Lovely tone, lovely quality. His rather mares had to be seen to be Oh, yes. <laughs> and then he was French origin, Stuckett. Mm. Stuckett, yeah. Yes. Anybody else that you met? Can you remember? Oh, Cotodrata. Oh, Madame Julieta Cotodrata. Yeah. She was wonderful. She was Italian. Ma Madame who? Madame Julieta Cotodrata. Cotodrata. Yes. <laughs> she was. Did she have any children? Italian. I don't think she had time. <laughs> By the time she pronounced her name. Mm -hmm. No, you see, she was quite sort of. 
Rebels. Rebels, yes. Yeah. And she would walk around backstage, say, you know, one of the Wagner roles, and she'd be banging her chest, saying, I cannot go on, I cannot go on. <laughs> and then she couldn't. <laughs> no breath left, you see. And, uh, but she was wonderful. No, she was a character. <laughs> she was a character. Yeah, well, yes. well, it's a lovely name, that, isn't it? Julieta Kotogarata. Yes. Kotogarata. Uh, Kotogarata. Is it Kotogarata? Kotogarata. 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 That's it. Kotogarata. Kotogarata. That's filled in five minutes. Oh, well, it's nice that you've had all those people that you've worked with and you've met all these wonderful ladies and, um, well, looking back on it, as one does occasionally, you know, it, it, it is a marvellous thing to have worked with all these great people. Well, the funny thing is, the ladies who stand out in one's memory, really, isn't it? Wouldn't you Yes. Say? Wouldn't yes. You say, like a tall brata, you know, people yes. like that. Well, I, th I think, you know, there, uh, there's a, actually a lady I'd like to tell you about. Uh, oh, carry on, oh. carry on. There's music teacher, you may. <laughs> there's a lady living somewhere. I think you could be right. And I love her for herself. And I'd die if she was missing from my grocer shed. What? Probably been evicted from my council house. Sarah Lee. <laughs> Sarah Lee. Your brioche just fractures me. What's a Something to be avoided. Give me a taste of. <laughs> <laughs> Your cherry Danish My mother bakes well But you can't compare her Not with Sara Lee Sara Lee, Sara Lee Sara Lee, Sara Lee, Sara Lee There's no H, just Sarah Lee But that's okay by me Slice in the kitchens of the one I love, wonderful Sarah Lee. Sarah Lee. And it thrills me right to my soul when I'm chewing her finger roll. Oh, I love you hear me saying, there's no mistake, there's never been a better banana cake. I love a cheesecake as white as pearl. That a chocolate swirl from the kitchen of the one I love. Wonderful Sarah, beautiful. <coughs> Well, there you are. Yes. I thought she knew to Oh, she did. Oh, really? Yes. After you. No, after you. Coffee to go. <laughs> the trouble of the boat today, it seems to me, is coffee in a cardboard cup. The trouble with the affluent society is coffee in a cardboard cup. No one's ever casual or nonchalant. No one wastes a minute in a restaurant. No one wants a waitress passing pleasantries like How you miss? How you sir? Could I take your order, please? The trouble of the day is plain to see Is everything is hurry up It's rushing through, don't be slow Beauty on right to go And Java, cup of joe Trouble the helps us go to life we leave It's coffee in a cardboard Do up, do up, do up, do up The trouble psychologists of all agree It's coffee in a cardboard wah, 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 wah. Tell me what could possibly be drearier Cardboard from the Belmore cafeteria It seems to me a gentleman would much prefer An afternoon, how you been? Well, would you like, like the specials of the trouble the one to see is pain to see is everything is hurry up? Everything is hurry up. It's ready whip. Let's 
in shades, a bit in rice. And microwave coffee. I think she said coffee. I know she said coffee. Bit of come on, come. Wow. He's dining at your local cornucopia. It seems to me we wouldn't be such girls, Rick. Hey, fella there. I'll be right back. Would you care for somebody to check? Ah! It's all over the world today. It's great, it's great, it's great. Everything is Oreo. Hurry up, it's all because fruity juice, sugar pints, and lights, it's booze and coffee, coffee, coffee. Thanks to Hinger Brackett. See you next week. Good night. God bless. Thank you very much. Good night. Yeah.